And on to the very first segment on the show with one of my favorite people in the world. Comedian Rob Van Feeren is a proud dad. After a really successful career that's seen him at the top of the South African comedy scene, the actor, writer and director decided it was time to shift gears, spread the love and start a family, a decision that has changed his life forever. He now joins Woolies for the A to Z of Daddy and Campaign, celebrating fathers across the nation. How are you? I'm amazing. Thank you so much you for having me. You are so amazing. Wow, I'm sounded, so happy to have you The way here. you described me, it sounded like my career was over now. It's done. <laughs> I've done it. I was quite relieved, actually. I can stop now. Thank you. OK, I first want to show you this clip. Have a look at this. Okay. And the next word describes me perfectly. Lunatic. Lunatic. This is so sweet. I absolutely <laughs> love this campaign. So we're talking fatherhood today. Did okay. fatherhood come naturally to you? Um, well, uh, sure. I don't think it comes naturally to anybody. Yeah. Um, it's, uh, it's like the biggest, most difficult job anyone can undertake ever. I mean, yeah. aside from motherhood, really. Yeah. Um, but being a parent is so massive and, uh, and like it's something you just can never prepare for. Yeah. Um, you seem like a good dad. You seem like a fun thank you. dad. And I mean, I always watch your Insta stories and I mean, you've got such an amazing little family. I want to know about the decision to become a father firstly. And you went through the process of adoption. Mm. Take me through that story. Um, so uh, my wife and I both have adoption in, in our family. So it was always yeah. like a, something we'd spoken about and something we, we wanted to do. Uh, when it came to deciding to start a family, um, we were terrified, I think, as, as everyone yeah. is. Um, and adoption just felt like that was the route for us. It was the, the path of least resistance. Yeah. Uh, and uh, it was an amazing, amazing experience from beginning. Really? Yeah. Uh, That's throughout. so good to hear. It's refreshing to hear. But what was the process like? Um, it's really it's really fascinating. Okay, so you've got to get, uh, get hold of a uh, social worker okay. who are working with um, tummy mummies or biological mothers, and yeah. they are t um, helping the biological mother through that the process of um, uh, uh, placing their children up for adoption and um, they also try and kind of match them with a family that is best suited to the biological mother. Yeah. In, in our case, we wrote a like a little family profile where you kind of describe your family and your whole kind of life philosophy yeah. uh, with pictures and your kind of extended family and your dreams for, for the family that you want to create. And then the social worker will then match that to a bi biological mother that they are working with. And the yeah. biological mother is normally given a, a choice of a couple of different profiles mm -hmm. and they will choose the profile that they feel best is best suited to them and their personality and, and the kind of home that they want their child to grow up in. And clearly with you, it was a perfect fit. Tell me about the first day that you met your daughter. We were um, lucky enough to be at uh, Bijou's birth. Um, uh, Tommy and Mummy decided to have Danny, my wife, in surgery oh, with her. amazing. Which was really amazing. I was standing out outside in the waiting room waiting, our palms sweating, yeah. absolutely terrified. Um, yeah, so they I love how you call forget. it Tummy Mummy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's very yeah. sweet. Um, and then Bij came out of, of the surgery, this, this tiny, tiny little little thing. Like, um, I mean, just the, this tiniest, most sweetest, most vulnerable little thing. And uh, we, the nurses kind of helped us um, uh, do some, like, you know, some bonding, skin yeah. to skin, and uh, showed us how to bath her, uh, helped Danny uh, uh, latch because Danny did uh, breastfed her, yeah. which is an amazing thing. Not a lot of people know Incredible. that uh, adoptive mothers can do that. How can you do that? By taking lactating uh, pills? Uh, yes, it helps okay. you with that. And then you have to uh, also milk 
um, y yourself to a degree to kind of uh, get the get the juices flowing, you know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 was, it was a process, <laughs> but it, it worked, and uh, Danny was able to to breastfeed, which was an incredible bonding experience wow. for the two of them. Yeah, and then that night we were in the hospital. I had to run off and back to the Baxter and do a show. Drove back oh. that night, like in a complete like Amazing. time warp. I was like, I can't believe what. But the best day of your life, to essentially. Me. Incredible. How do you think Bijou feels having you and a comedian as her father? Very bored. Do you think she's funny? It's so boring. Do you think she thinks you're funny? No. <laughs> no, she's critting me all the time. She's like, yeah, you know, I don't know about your jokes, Dan. Let's work oh, on this. So she's constantly working on it with We've me. We've got a little clip just to show exactly how much she loves you. <laughs> it's, it's all lies. <laughs> Look how cute this is. How does that one go? Dancing ever. Oh my god. This uh, is like men can't dance. That was terrible. <laughs> How embarrassing. That's our warm up dance because our, our, yeah. our challenge was whenever Bijou said we have to swim, yeah. then I have to swim. And she's a fish. She yeah. loves the water. She's impervious to the cold. And so the deal was for this Woolies campaign, it's like whenever I say swim, you swim. And I was like, okay, it's winter in That's Cape Town. How, where is this going to go wrong? No, I've been doing the ice bath swims here in the ocean and it's it's the hardest thing in the world. It's hectic. Like, it's so cold. But amazing. Yeah. It, it is amazing. amazing. Incredibly exactly. rejuvenating. Like there's no, I've never had a swim that I thought to myself, I, I wish I hadn't done that. Yeah, exactly. You never regret like no. a really good swim. No, never, so. except when you can't feel your fingers. So congratulations <laughs> for this Father's Day. We hope you have an amazing day. Thank you I'm so sure much. I'm sure Biju's going to light up your day just as you deserve. Thank you for being with us today. Thank we you love for having, having you. Me. Have a Beautiful day, you're the best. So what a beautiful story and one many South Africans can share across this vast and varied nation. So our thanks to our proud papa and comedian, Rob Van Furen, for sharing his story of fatherhood with us. And uh, today, to celebrate Dad this Father's Day, be sure to shop Woolworths Gifting in-store online at woolworths.co.za and, of course, on the Woolies app. Then you can also head to our Afternoon Express Facebook page for a link to shop now. And to elevate your gift this Father's Day, all you need to do is visit the Woolworths and Stanton, Eastgate, Gateway or Canal Walk stores on June the 15th and 16th for really amazing bespoke personalisation, engraving and wrapping. So here's to the best Father's Day yet. And the next word describes me perfectly. Lunatic! <laughs> <laughs>